Hey friends, it's Susan from LegsLikeMine.com. Wow, has it been a while since I talked to everybody. This has been a crazy month. And last week I got news that my disability retirement from the government was approved. But strangely, they gave me a one day notice to get out after working there for almost three decades, which was so strange and so shocking. And, um, I knew that I wanted to work on lipedema stuff and give myself the gift of being able to focus on one thing at a time. And I would say that my job, um, stress was the number one thing and travel too much, way too much travel. It was just blowing my legs up all the time. And at the level I was at, stress was just not something that could be removed. So they weren't able to accommodate my request to um, have less stress. And so they said, you know what, we can retire you. So that's what they did. And it took, oh, months and months and months of the Office of Personnel Management, like talking to doctors, my doctors, and looking at paperwork and all of my surgery records and stuff to say, yeah, um, we can't, we can't accommodate it. And yeah, oh yeah, um, stress is definitely that something that affects connective tissue disorders like um, hyper, hypermobile Ehlers Danlos syndrome, man, that's a mouthful, and lipedema. So they said, okay, you can go ahead and go. So anyway, um, I, this whole time for months and months and months, I've been working on footwear in the wee hours of the morning and trying to get it done um, before I started my day job every day and just putting a couple of hours a day into it and doing random photo shoots and stuff like that on the weekend. But now I can really focus on it as little or as much as I want to and hopefully be able to get the product out there. Um, someday I will write a book about discrimination in the workplace, but that's for another day. <laughs> that's all I'm going to say right now, but it's real. Um, anyway, there's some stuff that's pending and that's why I'm not talking about it too much, but ableism and discrimination are so real. It's crazy. Um, anyway, I have two outfits that I'm getting ready to post. I might spread them out a couple of days because one of them is Valentine's Day and I love this cute little dress. So I'm going to kind of get myself back up, um, and just pick it up. Um, tomorrow I've got, you know, last week I actually had meetings with consultants and our footwear technologist and designer and all that. And, um, we're working on connecting with our factory that we're looking at in Portugal now and um, just getting that fit perfect. So it may take a little bit more time, but the fit's got to be perfect or why do it, right? So um, anyway, that's a lot of just weird rambling, but I'm here. I'm still um, trying to get in that pool as often as I can. I've got it heated up right now for tomorrow because it's supposed to be nice weather and oh, my legs could use it right now. Um, talk about a wackadoodle week, man. <laughs> Um, anyway, I'm happy. I'm super happy. I just, uh, it's a final kick in the pants after working there for so long and really pouring my heart into work. So probably more than you needed to know, but it is going to be okay because now we'll just get our shoes and the books that I've been, um, kind of nursing along here for a while, um, out the door much quicker. So Anyway, I hope to see you soon and enjoy the outfit that I'm about to post for you because it is just wicked cute. All right, see y'all later. Have a good one. Bye.